you you need you need uh, i had that in chapter chapter one and I've, I've seen it in several other places and it's not it's not always this model but the, the one i prefer is like you need three three ingredients um so essentially you need to be somewhat unhappy with your current situation in order to change otherwise there's no reason to change right and that's fine right um then you need a a, a vision of of what could be and in my opinion, that vision needs to be at least somewhat personally actionable. I, I didn't have that in the book, but I realized that since, I mean, we can't create a vision of like an utopian vision. If we all agree, we can create this like fantastic world. That's not going to help very much, I would say. Yeah. And then you need a plan to get there, you know, from like literally from your position of discomfort to your vision. Yeah. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like so, a I mean, it's not, it's not for. I mean, I mean, what I'm proposing is not really. I, I'm not saying it's it's for everybody. I'm I'm just like throwing it out there. Uh, and I I I spend a lot of time on that. You know, thousands of hours writing blog posts in the book, uh, just to kind of pay paid forward. I mean, I always thought of I'm writing for people who were uh, for for people for the younger version of myself giving them material that I wish I had had myself so they don't have to go, go through the go through the same same process right and yeah. it's 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 crazy that this option is not is not presented but on the other hand it also makes makes a lot of sense because it's I think it, it, it it's a lot easier to just you know follow this I would almost say like religion you know where there's like only one answer you know you go you got to go to school you got to go through these these rituals so you can become like really good at um, yeah following instructions and handing things in on time you know and the better you are at that the higher the grades you get and the more self-worth you get and this is kind of what we go into right yeah. and if, if you suddenly start questioning that while people go through that process you know then you have you almost have chaos right yeah. so I'm, I'm not really sure what like a, a super general education was uh so it's it's, it's one of those like um uh, what's the saying something like the when when the student is ready the teacher appears uh right. so um and, and and fortunately this is getting more widespread so people at least hear about it uh yeah. so that helps a lot i'd say no so no. I, in, in in that sense the plans are now out there definitely so no. so <laughs> and that, yeah yeah no and i thank you for for having the the you know the initiative to put yourself out there and, and share your ideas because for me at least you know like at this time of my life this is a this is a a crossroad this is i i have a choice now right yeah. i have i can be truth to myself and truth to myself not being following your book necessarily or following any other book rather having the the space to critical critically think who am i going to be in this world and if my role is only to be an accountant for 30 years is my role having an identity through my career, like when I get asked the question, who are you? How do you answer that without, your, without saying, I graduated from here, mm -hmm. then this is the, the things that you do that, rather yeah, than the things I mean, that you are? I, I, I'm personally having a, I find, I find answering that extre ex extremely difficult actually, yeah. because like the uh, cultural convention is you just give you a job title. Like,